Hello everyone, my name is Emma and welcome back to Let's Play Unstable Part 3. Okay, so, uh, this game doesn't really have any save mechanics, so, <laughs> fortunately, um, I have to keep going until I, uh, I finish the game, which, as I said in the last one, it's not a bad thing, it's just annoying because I kind of want to do other things as well, just like record once in a day, um, and yeah, I feel like this one's going to be a trap because it's like completely lit up, don't hit 6 frames which is not necessary, oh, okay I need to collect 5 of them, Oh my god, 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 that guy's naked. <laughs> that's, that's the most, um, that, that's the, that's the worst. Oh my, ugh. Does it kind of like Life is Strange? Hey. Oh shit, he's actually coming towards me now. Unlike the last times. Where he was just like. Okay, he ran off. Bye bye. <sighs> There's a gas can all the way out here. Wow. That is a wow. Oh, there's a house all the way out here. Okay. That will make some kind of sense if there's anything out here. I don't know how long I was walking out there for. I like out the other side just trying to find something. There might be a, a, something else on the other side. I'll go there if I can't see anything. Why do I need five? It's like a big... This looks like... That seriously looks like a trap. It's one more. One more I need to find. Holy shit. I freaking found it, oh my god, next to a truck. <sighs> What's the other? Go to the car. Go to your car, yay. Finally, oh my god. Ah, rude awakening. In the forest, Sarah c had caught something. Maybe. It looked like pose possession. Two days later, one morning. She caught something. Sound uh, looks like possession or something. What? Hang on. What the hell? Copyright music. Great. This is old as well. It's like... I don't know my music times, but what the hell? This is kind of like a joke. <laughs> the way, oh, she caught a flu, like, oh, you caught a flu. No, she caught possession. Yeah, those things are weird. This is like at the end, ending scene, something like that. This is going to be a very short video. I don't even know how long I was walking around. I've been recording for 13 minutes, so I don't know how long this video is going to be. <laughs> Did she jump? Yeah, she jumped from a building. Ouch. Yay, the end. That was an amazing game, I must say. Like, um, yeah. So, developed by Bast YT, uh, publisher JIF Company, created with Unity 5. Okay, so, yeah, this. Okay, translation. Yeah, so I thought it was translated because 
uh, languages don't necessarily translate perfectly. Well, yeah, so, um, yeah, so that was really sounds, was there any, like, uh, music, okay, so, National Russian, a uh, Russian National Anthem, seriously? Holy crap, how much was there in this? <laughs> Oh my god! I what? I don't remember. I I know the piano song because that was p played on obviously the piano, and I know two other songs, but I don't know what they would be called. Um, thanks to beta testers. Okay. Many other YouTubers. Okay. Thanks for playing my game. Culture geek YT. Okay. So yeah, that was an amazing game. I absolutely enjoyed it. I, uh, well, yeah, that, that was really fantastic. Uh, the, fir the first part, it was to be continued. Exit to quit the game. Okay, so, yeah, that was really good. It was, it, unfortunately it had copyright music in it, so, well, but it didn't, uh, there was like no storytelling or whatever, so I was just talking through it. Um, so yeah, I won't exactly know what parts were copyright, because there was a lot of songs in that, but there was no copyright part for the first part, because that's already up, obviously, because it's the third part. Um, but yeah, so, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I really did. I need to put this as a, um, uh, on, on, on a playlist, because, it's just, yeah. <laughs> But yeah, this, this was really good. I really enjoyed it. It was... It, it could have been a lot scarier, I must say. It was a nice little story. Um, and... Yeah, it, the, the monsters were really cool. Uh, it wasn't really threatening, though, at all. Throughout the whole entire asylum, I wasn't threatened at all. Uh... I was slow, obviously, I was feeling threatened because I didn't know if there was anything actually chasing me or not because I had seen uh, some of the screenshots from the game on IndieDB, uh, which was the collecting the gas and stuff, so uh, that was the only threatening part, and especially the part where you had to run away, that was extremely threatening, but uh, yeah, it was really good. It built up pretty well, and I just thought the gas thing was a little bit... Um, kind of tedious in a way. Well, I, I reckon that's because it was... Uh, the, the last the last one was the hardest to find because it was just a... It was right next to a car, so I think that, like, if I passed that before, whatever, it was like, it would have been camouflaged. <laughs> but yeah, so, it was fantastic uh, all around. Uh, not really much anything to improve on, I'd say, uh, because it was pretty, it was pretty bloody good. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, thank you guys for watching, hope you enjoyed, uh, like my page on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, if you guys want to get the game for yourself, or check out anything by the developers, I probably will, uh, link to in the IndieDB page, or the game's IndieDB page, uh, is in the description below, and I will see you guys in the next video, bye bye!